Manchester United have signed or agreed to sign Daniel James yeah. from Swansea. It's a strange signing for Manchester United. But no, they don't. They don't have an identity anymore. It seems like everything is so disconnected from everything else that they do. There's no pattern, and there's no. You can't say a clear direction. All the best on James, and, and he could turn out to be a brilliant player. I don't know them. Where are the marquee signs? They are a massive club. They should be able to sign big players from. Maybe, maybe they like they still already days. Maybe they will. Like it. But like, do you think also that United are? If they throw, there's bound to be certain players that if you throw a certain amount of money at them, they will go to your club no matter what. But also, players these days are a lot more savvy with wanting to go to clubs that are on the rise rather than the United are certainly on a decline. They're not in the Champions League. That is not appealing to a player. I think it's that, right? Not being in Champions League. And I think it's the fact that it's, no disrespect, it's Solskjaer. And he hasn't done anything yet to, to warrant players who want to come and play for him. If they had a bigger name there. Like a Pep or a Klopp or... Or Mourinho, do you know that type of thing? Or Conte or even Sarri. Or Chelsea weren't in it. They got Jorginho. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I mean? It's a strange one. Manchester United fans, if you're listening to the podcast or you're watching this here, let us know how you feel on it. Like, Let us know what you think about the Daniel James saying and whether you think it's a good one, whether you're excited or whether you're just like, that's what's going on.